God gave me a prophetic analogy. This morning when I got up and I went downstairs to my house, I'm not finished. And I saw on my, um, I saw on the floor of my living room, and it was like this little black thing. It looked like a, 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 a worm. And I thought, oh, how did that get in there? Because I lock all my windows at night, and all my doors are locked at night. And when I bent down to look at what it was, it was a slug. And I was like, God, how did a slug get into my house? Meaning I was away from the home all day. It was locked up all day yesterday. The house was locked up all night, right? And I said, Lord, how on earth did a slug get into my home? This is crazy. And I went and I picked up the slug. And then the Lord said, somebody had brought me a gift. Now, this has nothing to do with the gift that somebody gave me. But somebody had brought me a gift the night before. And it was, it was a plant. And the Lord said, look, they brought something in to bless you with. But look at what was attached to the plant. Now the Lord said, Get very, be very careful in this hour who you associate with. I'm not talking about that person that brought me the gift. Thank you. But God used it as a prophetic message, as a prophetic example, as a prophetic illustration that many times we we build associations and we allow things into our gates, meaning into our ears, into our mind, into what we read. And little do we know that the things we are allowing in are bringing attachments. And God says, be wary.